It's a big county with a big crime problem. So why is the sheriff's department not taking calls on certain days? If it's a Wednesday or Thursday and it's not a matter of life or death, call someone else. How'd you like to hear that? The sheriff's office in one of the state's largest counties claims it has too much to do and too few people to do it, so it is not taking regular calls on those two days. News 13's Alex Tomlin has that from the Newsplex. The sheriff says his deputies are overworked and exhausted, and he has no choice but to cut down on their workload. We're working these deputies uh, uh, far, far longer and far harder than what is safe. Real Arriba County Sheriff Tommy Rodella is in charge of the biggest county in the state. In fact, it's bigger than Connecticut, but you wouldn't know it by the size of his staff. This county has a population of 45,000. We have 17 deputies. He says he needs double that number, but getting the deputies is only half the battle. The sheriff says not only does he not have enough deputies, he doesn't have enough patrol cars or equipment for them to use, something he says costs about $100,000 per position. Rodella says on top of daily deputy duties, the office is also in charge of tracking sex offenders, serving residents with court papers, providing court security and transporting suspects from all over the state back to the county for court. He said he had no choice but to back down his force two days a week. Wednesday and Thursday, my issue is we have criminal docket in, in Terra Maria. Deputies have to transport suspects to those hearings and back and provide court security. I'm telling you right now, we're doing more than our fair Share. Rodella says unless it's an emergency like a murder, a serious car crash, or an armed robbery in progress, the calls are going to have to be passed on. And who's picking up the line? New Mexico State Police have stepped up to the plate and have adjusted our schedules accordingly. State police don't have a lot of officers in Rio Arriba County either. Normally we have anywhere, anywhere from two to five on a shift. Lieutenant Eric Garcia said they will make sure all calls are handled. But who knows how long this could go on. What we need is for the commission to authorize additional men. The sheriff says he only has the money to hire two more deputies right now. I spoke to the Rio Reba County Commission Chair, who says the commission has made it clear once the sheriff fills those positions, he can come back to them and plead his case for more hires. Dick. Okay, Alex, according to Sheriff Rodella, crime in his county is growing as his force shrinks. State police do say Rio Reba is their busiest district in the entire state.